Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Recently we have seen two important updates coming out regarding the development of AMCA. First one was reported by Hindustan Times according to which India and France are close to conclude a deal likely in next couple of months for the joint development of 125 kN engine. The collaboration is between DRDO and French engine maker Safran. If the work starts on the engine development, we can expect a flight worthy 125 kN domestic engine in 6 years and another 3 to 4 years for flight testing. The new engine will power MK MK2 which will see the first flight around 2030 or 31 and will enter production by 2035. Recently, we have made a video on EOTS, which is being developed for MK. If you have missed this video, the link can be found in description section and the i button. EOTS is a 2-in-1 system with capability of IRST and targeting port. It is a passive sensor and does not emit any RF signal like PSA and ASA radars, making it completely silent. If the fighter jet turn off its radar and tracks and attack another fighter using EOTS, it will be element of surprise for them and hence it is considered as an important aspect of 5th generation stealth fighter jet. The EOTS being developed for AMCA is ready and its flight trials will commence soon. The test bed for EOTS is going to be Hawker 800 aircraft which has been earlier used for testing Uttam AES radar by DRDO. Now, as we are all aware that design configuration of MK is frozen, its preliminary design review is complete and at present fighter jet is in critical design review stage. The CDR of fighter jet is expected to complete by mid of this year which is not very far. Once the CDR is complete, MK will be ready for prototype development. However, we have also seen last year many critical parts such as actuators have been developed for AMCA which was displayed during defense minister visit to HL Bengaluru. Now today, HL has officially announced via its Twitter handle that it has started the manufacturing activity for AMCA in association with ADA. This is my friend an excellent news for Indian defense industry and shows the government and Air Force commitment in getting MK in air as soon as possible. The first prototype rollout of MK is not very far away and it is planned by 2023 and first flight by 2024. The production of MK is likely to kick start in the next 7 to 8 years. HL is looking to commence production between 2026 to 2028 and full-fledged production will commence by 2029. The Indian Air Force modernization roadmap involves the deployment of around 126 stealth fighters which is close to 6 squadrons considering 36 MK MK1 and 90 MK MK2. The development of MK will happen in two phases. In phase 1, two squadrons of MK MK1 will be produced powered by American G414 engines. In phase 2, the four squadrons of MK MK2 will be produced which will be an advanced version of MK with 6th generation technologies and will be powered by indigenous engine likely to replace the imported G414 engines. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.